Hey, hello everybody, how are you? I hope you're doing great. I'm gonna show you a line twisting sign that is gonna be the frog that I already made it in Spanish and this is a two balloon design. So let's do this. It's just inflate a five inch round, approximately four finger inflated. That's gonna make things easier because what you need to do, and there's many different, probably the different ways, but what I like to do is make a bubble here, one of the sides, and then the other side too, and if you can, the same size grade, grab those two bubbles, put it there. It's the, the middle one, this middle big bubble, pull and twist. That is that. What is that? The pinch twist. It's like a pinch twist. So then you create with that idea, that concept, two eyeballs, and then here the mouth for a frog. So then you will need a balloon. This is a 160 Decomex. Why? Uh, because I think with the 160, you will have enough for everything, you know, that is going to be the rest of the body. So it's like approximately seven finger tail and you need to start attaching it to here. So let's do that. So just pass it around a couple of times and then just measure five finger long or four and then three little bubbles. That's what I'm doing. Three little bubbles twist and then a bubble pinch twist. Now, you have to just kind of repeat whatever you made here. You make one bubble, another bubble, and then from here, repeat three bubbles and a bubble pinch twist. So just hold it because they can get a twist. And then you have to twist it again. So I'm making here the three bubbles and a bubble pinch twist. So then I'm going up now with another four or five finger long. And you're gonna end up here in the center and this is gonna be a cool idea, the moment to kind of pull down this when you grab and measure three finger long, not that much, it's just a small design, and pass it through. That's helping to keep this lower. Um, you know, not like looking too high, too up like this. Okay, now, you twist it there, you see the middle of these two little bubbles, make the connection, and then you're gonna measure something that's three finger long, and then make a four finger loop, another four finger loop, and you will have exactly, and this is the cool part about this design, whatever is here, just make a bubble at the end, and that bubble, you're gonna connect it right here in the back of the eyeballs. Uh, so to do that, you grab it, with your thumb, you push, and kind of like pull and twist, twist all that together. And then you have something like this. I'm gonna show you how things are looking, but that bubble goes in the back. So, look, it's a very cool, I think it's a cute design, an idea. In, so now you have two eyeballs, this is space for the mouth, and it's just sharp time. Now, you can make it more elaborated, but I'm gonna show you kind of like the fast way, it's just make a big circle, and then cover inside with a circle there, and a little one, and the rest you co color it. You can even make, Kind of like an eyeball and repeat the other side the same a big circle and a small circle and the rest coloring okay it's just an idea and then from the mouth something like this i think represents better what is the the frog uh, mouth the nose you can make two dots there and then this is kind of the extra thing a wristband that is a hair tie you just grab it, or it can be with balloon, but you just pass it there and then stitch your froggy there. With Sharpie, you just color it, pew, 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 dots. And three dots, you know, like a spread around, but you need a dark green. This is too, too light. Oh, here's one dark. Dark Sharpie. Uh, so three dots. And that same idea around, you know, different spots. It can be bigger, whatever you want, even around the eyeballs. So, any space that you think you can do this, great. And that's the design that I think is cool. A lot of times people ask you for a frog and this can be kind of one of the light twisting versions. Tell me in the comment what you think and don't forget, like, comment, subscribe if you're watching this from a YouTube channel. If you're not watching this from a YouTube channel and you are on TikTok, well, I invite you to subscribe to my YouTube channel because it's there when I, where I have more, you know, uh, tutorials and with more time to explain because these ones have to be very short. So there it goes. Have fun. Bye-bye.